Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. Welcome back to my channel. If you're a YouTube creator and you're looking to download music that you can use in your YouTube videos and you don't have to worry about any copyright strike, which means Creative Commons music. If you want to download such music, this video is going to be very helpful for you because we're going to talk about how to download music from YouTube, which you can use in your YouTube videos and you wouldn't be getting any copyright strike. So let's begin. First of all, you need to open up any browser. So if you're using Google Chrome, if you're using Safari, just open up any of your browsers. In my case, I'm gonna open up Safari and then go to youtube.com. Just type youtube.com and open up the website. Now, when you open youtube.com on your phone, it's going to open up like this. You need to do a couple of things. If you're using a Google Chrome browser on the top right corner of your screen, you're gonna see three dots. You need to click on those three dots. In my case, I'm using Safari. So on the bottom left corner of my screen, I'm going to click where it says double A and I'm going to click request desktop website. You need to do the same thing on your Google Chrome browser if you're using an Android device. And after you click request desktop website, it's going to change the view. And now we can see the desktop view. This is the same view that you see on your PC, laptop, computers. And by the way, I just missed one thing that when you open youtube.com, if you're not logged on to YouTube or if you're not logged on on the browser, you need to first log in with your account, with your YouTube account. Okay, now once you've done that, you're gonna see your profile picture on the top right corner. So let me just zoom it in. So the profile picture that you see on the top right corner, you need to tap on this. And then you need to click YouTube Studio. So it's going to open up YouTube Studio for you after it opens up. On the left side, the very last option in my case that I see, it's audio library. So you need to click on this. It's going to open up audio library. You guys can see that there are multiple songs that I can see here and I can, you know, just search for one. I can actually pick which, what type of song I want to download. I can choose the genre. So if I click genre, I can, you know, maybe choose ambient. If it's a vlog that you're trying to edit, you can choose ambient music. Just check this box, apply, and it's going to filter only those type of tracks for you. So now we've got all the ambient tracks uh, on our screen in the list. And then you can also pick music or sound effects from here as well. You can see the second tab is sound effects and third is start. The song that you want to download, you can actually play, you have this play button with every track. So you can play the track just to listen to it and see if this is good, if it fits you, your type of video, nature of the video. And after you've selected that, you guys can see that there is an option to download it on the right side of the screen. So I can just tap download and it's gonna start downloading. So let me just go ahead and do that just for a moment. So I've just tapped download. And as you guys can see, I got an option to download this music in my phone. So I just simply click download. And if I go in my downloads, you guys would be able to see that the song is already downloading. In fact, it has already downloaded. Now I can use this track in my YouTube videos and I wouldn't be getting any kind of copyright strike. There wouldn't be any issues and my video wouldn't be demonetized. I wouldn't be getting any claims, copyright strikes, etc., etc. Uh, this music is absolutely safe to use on your YouTube videos. There are multiple tracks here available here. So you can choose, pick and choose. You can download multiple songs all at once. Just keep them at a safe place with you so that whenever you're editing your next video, next YouTube video, based on the nature of that video, you can use that type of music. Or you can always come back here, download music, just listen to music that suits your video and apply it on your videos. You can do the same thing with your PC, with your laptop uh, or your phone. I have just shown you how to do that on your phone because I've seen some videos where people were doing it on their laptops or PCs, but it's pretty easy. You can do it on your phone as well. If you guys have any questions related to this, you can let me know in the comments section. I try to read all your comments and respond to them as well. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, if you're new here, do consider subscribing. It helps a lot and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Bye-bye.